Alright guys, I want to do a quick review of this two gallon Pet Dot large pet water fountain that we got for our Great Danes. Uh, it goes for about 55 bucks on Amazon. I'll leave a link in the description below. I've had it for about a month now and I figured someone someone clean, I'll show you guys how to put it together and then show you guys how it works. The reason we got it is our Great Danes, they drool a lot when they drink. So a normal uh, water bowl would just fill up with drool and you have to clean out like two or three times a day where this will filter out the drool and you won't have to clean out but maybe once a month. So let's go ahead and get started. So here's everything that comes in the box. You got the bowl, you got the top of the bowl, you have the uh, pump with the plug, just a USB so you can use a normal charging brick too, I guess if you need to. It comes with two filters. I'm only using one right now. You've got the actual, I guess, fountain part that goes on top. And then this little clip thing that holds the filter in the water. Now when you get it, these are all separate. You just have to put this tube over that and then push this down. Put the start. You just stick the filter in here. Pick it up. And it hooks on the side. You have this little filter that goes right between where the water comes in and the pump. If your pump is not pushing a lot of water out the top or you see that um, the fountain's going slow, it's probably because this is dirty, you just gotta clean that off. From here you'll take the top of the bowl or the fountain. You have this, it's got two little nubs sticking out. Just line up with that, put it in there. You take the bottom and you screw it in. Don't do it too tight because all of this is plastic, so it will, it could crack, I guess. And then from there, you can just stick it in the bowl. Just make sure the cord fit is going through this little hole right here. And that's it. And then you just fill it up to the max line and it'll start pumping the water through. So let's go ahead and put some water in and let it run. All right, now it's filled up and running. It's a really quiet uh, fountain. You can also see that I didn't add water to the top, but I just had to start with water in the bottom and it does bring it down one notch. You could fill it up to max and then fill this up with water and then turn it on. That way you're still at max, but you can always just add more water to the top and then it'll go into the bottom and fill it up. Now, whenever drool or something gets in here, it won't go straight to the filter right away. It'll kind of float around until it catches the right flow of the water and it'll go down into the filter in the bottom. Overall, it's a good product. If you have really messy dogs that make a mess in their drinking bowl, it'll help keep it clean and you want to clean it out as much. I definitely recommend it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later.